So I got these tow mirrors for my Ford E350. Red where one guy said it was real easy to put on. I got the passenger side on and it wasn't real easy. I had to do some research on YouTube and find out how to take that door panel off. So anyways, I got these tools for taking car parts off. Plastic so they don't. So you go up here, unclip this off. And I was under the impression that it was just going to be these three. But that's not the case because there's one down in there's one down in there. So this door panel had to come off. So I'm going to take that door panel off now and I'm going to show you how to do it. Phillips head, that comes off. You can see this cover right in there. That comes off. Just get a small screwdriver. There's a screw in here. This comes off and this slides out. And be careful not to lose these metal clips. And there's a, another screw right in there. And this comes up. Two clips here as well. There's two wire harnesses they just clip off. It's for the uh, power windows and door locks. And there's one more screw down below here. That is all of them. There will be a wire harness for that. Now this door panel lifts up. Hopefully I can unclip this. Just press that in and pull it out. You can see these hooks here. That's how that hooks on. This is 716, it's got four nuts here. Now there's a, a wire for the power mirror. So it looks like I need to take this speaker out to unplug the mirror adjustment harness. The connector is fastened to the door frame with a, it's kind of a, almost a, a barbed connector. All right, so that undoes that. I need to clean around this old mirror, get rid of that trash. Need to trim this gasket down a little bit. It's a little long, a tad wide. Cut a larger hole for the wire harness. It's got an adhesive back. This new mirror this thing weighs almost 11 pounds. Some kind of cast metal, and the other one's all plastic. So I got a nut, feed that wire harness in there, put that top one on, holds the mirror. Snug each nut down a little bit. This is the, the new wire, there's only one way it can go. And then this barbed fastener will go back in the hole hopefully there it is popped right in let's get this speaker mounted first thing you got to do is wire up the mirror and I think that's it that thing just fell right in there that's nice let me check make sure that mirror works yeah, it does. Okay, let's screw this thing back on. Put these four screws in. Okay, this goes on from the back. Screw this on. And that clip, there's two little slots where that fits in. Let's get this thing back on here. Those two wire harnesses clip in. Pop down. Let's see how we work. Mirror works, windows work, locks work. One more cover, this down at the bottom. Then this clips on here. That tab goes behind the door panel. That's a wrap. Bada bang, a bada boom.
Driving in a 66 Mustang Staring at the smell of burning gasoline Chasing 